Hasbro Family Game Night is a video game released for the PlayStation 2 and Wii published by Electronic Arts. It is a mini game collection consisting of six Hasbro board games Battleship, Boggle, Connect 4, Sorry, Sorry, Sliders, and Yahtzee. The games all have traditional versions as well as advanced variants exclusive to the Family Game Night package. The mini game collection is hosted by Mr. Potato Head. It was released on November 11, 2008. Hasbro Family Game Night was also released on Xbox 360 Live Arcade on March 18, 2009 as a free hub application, with the individual games available for separate purchase. A disc-based copy of the game was released in November 2009. In North America, the Xbox 360 version includes Scrabble along with the previous six games. On June 24, 2010 three downloadable games were released on Xbox 360, Jenga, Connect 4x4 and Picturka. Hasbro Family Game Night was made available for download on the PlayStation 3 from PlayStation Store on October 29, 2009. This release features the main six games, with the North American version also featuring Scrabble, and is presented in widescreen format with PlayStation Network support. A sequel was announced in May 2009. Hasbro Family Game Night 2 was released for the Wii and Nintendo DS in October 2009. Another sequel, Hasbro Family Game Night 3, was announced in May 2010 and it was released in October of the same year. Hasbro Family Game Night 4, the game show was announced in May 2011. <laughs> Playable games Battleship Boggle Connect 4 Sorry Sorry Sliders Yahtzee Topic <laughs> Game Night 2 List of playable games Topic <laughs> <laughs> Wii version Operation Bop It Connect 4x4 Jenga Picturka Nintendo DS version Operation Bop It Connect 4 Battleship on June 23, 2010, three of the games, Picturka, Jenga, and Connect 4x4 were added to Xbox Live Arcade and PlayStation Network versions of Family Game Night available as online distribution. <laughs> Game Night 3 Hasbro Family Game Night 3 was released on October 26, 2010 for the PlayStation 3, Wii and Xbox 360. List of playable games Console version The Game of Life Clue Twister Mouse Trap Yahtzee Hands Down Game Night 4 Hasbro Family Game Night 4, the game show is a video game in the Family Game Night series, released for PlayStation 3 with Move, Wii and Xbox 360 with Kinect, with the former two uses the PlayStation Move and Kinect respectively, inspired by the television show. All of the commentary is voiced by Todd Newton, who is also the show's host. Unlike past games, an online mode is not included in the game, due to EA's online pass requirement not applicable to budget titles as the game has a $39.99 USD price tag. List of playable games Bop It! Boptagon Connect 4 Basketball Scrabble Flash Sorry! Sliders Yahtzee Bowling Hasbro Family Fun Pack Hasbro Family Fun Pack is a video game released for PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. List of playable games Scrabble Trivial Pursuit Live Monopoly Plus 
Risk the Wii version of the game received mixed reviews from critics. The review aggregator site GameRankings has an average score of 64% for the Wii version, based on 11 reviews. IGN rated it as 7 out of 10, decent, and said that control and interpretation issues cause problems for some of the games. Games Master UK magazine said, Overall, this does everything you'd want it to, and no more. It reviews concluded about the Xbox 360 version, we would pass on Battleship, which just didn't hold our attention and had fairly weak variants. Connect 4 is worth a pop, though, with alternative play modes that really bring the game to life, and Yahtzee is certainly a little gem for the asking price. <laughs> game Night 4 Reception of the game has been mixed to poor. The Xbox 360 and Wii versions were the highest rated versions on game rankings, with scores of 37% while the PS3 version was slightly below them at 35%. Push Square claimed that the game was much more fun with another person, but was still, "...a harsh drop-off in quality compared to other Hasbro Family Game Night titles," and gave the game a 3 tenths. Official Xbox Magazine UK gave it a 3 tenths, claiming that the games were poorly represented and saying this casts doubt on whether Hasbro understand what makes its non-digital games good. Whatever the reasons behind FGN4 this is reprehensible. <laughs>